here we go again guys another bloody security warning video i feel like i've been making these quite a bit recently because yeah unsurprisingly there is a lot of bad actors on roblox these days roblox is such a dodgy platform there is just so many hackers and scammers but we've got a security warning here from rollymons and they've said multiple roblox related browser extensions have reportedly turned malicious today if you see a prompt on roblox asking you to update your birthday don't click it we recommend you uninstall any roblox extensions that aren't fully trustworthy at this time to be safe there may be other approaches these extensions use as well but the update birthday approach is the most common for now okay so this is something new and um oh they've provided an example of what it looks like so they've said warning certain roblox extensions are using malicious code and had this pop-up injected into them do not click this prompt and remove non-trustworthy roblox extensions so it says update your birthday your birthday appears incorrect please update your birthday in settings and you've got a button to update birthday i'm gonna be honest right whoever the dodgy twat was that came up with this that was actually pretty smart but then again it is a bit random like if your birthday is verified then it's going to be correct anyway right because when you submit your id it like verifies it with your account so for me personally if one of the extensions i used got hacked and this popped up i probably wouldn't fall for it i'll just like completely ignore it right but apparently if you click the button it just drains your robux from your balance and your group as well rollymons did a bit more digging and they said you can see in this code from one of the malicious extensions that it's apparently hunting for victims with wrap robux or group funds oh so maybe it takes limiteds as well oh well yeah look at this minimum wrap 100,000 minimum robux 50,000 minimum pending robux 100,000 oh man that's dodgy so it waits for your robux to pend while you've got the extension installed and then it takes it man these guys are kind of smart and then we've got minimum group funds 30,000 so they're looking for rich players which is kind of interesting because I think the previous people which hacked these extensions they would just target like anybody at all even some like random 10 year old with like a limited shaggy on his account like the previous guys didn't care but it looks like these guys only really want rich accounts so for most of you watching this video no offense but you're probably safe right unless you've got like a hundred thousand robux laying around then you're probably a target I'm gonna sound like a broken record at this point but I just want to say row seal row gold better roblox row pro roblox plus anything else i've covered on the channel right all of that stuff is safe and i just want to repeat myself because otherwise people are going to go in the comments and say shark blocks what about row pro what about better roblox don't worry guys if any of those extensions got hacked i would cover it instantly also i've literally got like dms and connections with all of the developers behind this stuff so they would probably tell me like straight away so all of those are safe don't worry but what isn't safe is that dodgy crap and trash that i always tell you guys not to install stuff like row searcher row search blocks row finder player searcher roblox anything called that is obviously going to be a scam and i've been covering stuff like this for the past four years so at this point if you're installing those dodgy applications i'm not even going to feel bad for you if you get hacked and i know that sounds so mean but these dodgy extensions have been talked about for like five years now i feel like avoiding this stuff is just common sense and if you're downloading it well that's on you also i want to say if you're installing extensions please use the chrome web store because i know a few months ago people were making like fake extensions on firefox and edge and stuff was it better roblox somebody made like a fake version and people were installing it if you guys ever want the real stuff as well just go to the video on my channel just go to the description and install it from there actually i'll tell you what i'll do you guys a favor i'll link all the real stuff down below in this video so you can always come back to it if you want to you know install the legit stuff but one thing i'm curious about guys does search blocks even still exist Exist. search blocks oh my god it still exists i swear to god right if i get a dm from some guy saying shark blocks i installed search blocks and now all my robux is gone i'm literally just gonna tell him it's not my problem and nothing to do with me because i'm just sick of this flipping extension it always comes back god there must be so many like victims of search blocks this hurts my eyes as well Thirty thousand users what is wrong with these people if you're over like the age of i don't know 13 and installing this you might just be dumb i know i'm being rude but we've been covering this for four years why are people still installing this it blows my mind unless they're all bots or something but jesus you've just got to be an absolute idiot to install this what was the other one was it like row finder or blocks finder oh god okay to be fair i don't know if these are getting people hacked but i would probably bet money on it right i would bet at least like a thousand dollars that people that installed this got hacked
hacked. 100,000 users is ridiculous. I can't believe this, guys, you know? I kind of feel like all of those, like, scam videos that I've done over the years have just been completely useless. To see something like this have over 100,000 users, like, why did I even bother making the vids, right? Oh, my God, you can't make this up. Look at this, right? I just saw this tweet from Rollymons only 38 minutes ago. Update regarding the malicious Roblox browser extension situation. Here is a list of reportedly affected extensions for Chrome and Edge. Would you look at that, guys? The stuff I pointed out is on the list and more. Looks like a fake uh, row gold or something. There's probably loads. Do you know what I'm going to say, guys, right? If you're really not computer savvy and you're the type of person that would see search blocks and install it, just stop installing stuff altogether. Like, it's not going to do you any favors, right? Just don't use them. Also, the whole idea behind search blocks was just irritating in the first place, like stalking developers and YouTubers. Just leave people alone, man. It's so annoying. This type of stuff does frustrate me, you know, because I kind of feel like it's just like a forever losing battle. No matter how many times we talk about this stuff and make videos about it and make tweets and posts and things, people are just going to ignore it and still install this stuff. So I don't really know what we can do at this point. Anyway, leave a like, subscribe, and um, yeah, see ya.